interesting fact people might not know about me was, or is, I'm a dual international, so I played uh, for the Tall Ferns when I was 16, and I debuted for the Silver Ferns when I was 18, I think it was. I was offered three college scholarships in the States to play basketball, and I guess I decided to turn that down because I wanted to be a Silver Fern, and my goal's always been to be a dual international. Tēnā tātou katoa, ko Maya Wilson tō kuingua, he kai tākoro au mō ngā kapa, ngā kāpunga, me te Robin Hood stars. Welcome to my world. It's a big year ahead for me this year. We've got the Commonwealth Games coming up in July with the Silver Ferns, but first off, the ANZ Premiership is starting off soon, so I'm going to give you a little insight into a few of my workouts, and today is a bit of a strength session. It wasn't until I got a phone call from my marama Tomonu when I was about 16 years old that I realised I could have a pathway in sport, in particular as a career. Once I finally picked up my first uh, professional contract out of school, I realised yeah, I needed to put the work in, so a lot of time in the gym, um, but most importantly running as well, making sure my body is my job and my vehicle, so I need to make sure that I'm in tip-top shape, so hitting the bar today, and yeah. I've had my fair share of non-selection and rejection in my career and I guess for me in the moment it absolutely sucked. I was given some feedback and I guess from that feedback I didn't really 100% like that so I took that feedback on and made sure that next time that wasn't going to be the reason why I didn't get selected so I worked my butt off and yeah was lucky to reap the rewards of been back in the Silver Fern side, so really psyched to be there at the moment. So this is my sixth season for the Stars, and I guess for me, why I'm so passionate about the Stars is I grew up in Auckland, but in particular in South Auckland, so I've got a lot of pride for the people, and I happen to be actually from South Auckland, so I'm mana whenua, my I come from a small little hapu called Te Akitai in Māngere and so to be able to represent my people on my whenua is really important to me and I guess is also a chance for me to be a role model for my nieces and nephews that run around in our pa that no matter what you can dream, uh, you can achieve. I've had many highlights throughout my career. Number one would definitely be debuting for the Silver Ferns. Been stoked to be able to solidify myself in the starting seven and starting to own that goal shoot bib. And who doesn't love winning against the Aussies and to win the Constellation Cup, which was the first time in 12 years, I'm really stoked that I was able to contribute to that. I'm so excited, I have finally finished my degree, which was a Bachelor of Communications at Mass University. It's a three-year degree, but I've been studying part-time, so it's taken me six years. So I guess for me, studying was something that I really wanted to do, as I know netball's not going to be around forever, the body isn't going to be able to do that for the long term, so I just wanted to make sure I had something for myself post netball career, and it's been quite cool. I've dabbled in a bit of television lately, so it's nice to see that, yeah, some opportunities are coming up, and who knows where I'm gonna be.